New this morning, the Arkansas General Assembly has wrapped up its regular business for this legislative session. It comes after the Senate passed a new gun rights bill during a late night meeting. Michael Aaron live at the state capitol with the new developments. Yeah, guys, that bill is now headed to the governor's desk after passing along party lines in both chambers. It declares invalid any federal gun restrictions passed on or after January 1st of this year that violate the constitutional right to bear arms. Uh, Republicans pushing to block federal gun restrictions in Arkansas and in other states, citing concerns over President Biden's proposed gun control measures. Under this bill, local and state law enforcement cannot enforce federal restrictions that conflict with the state constitution's right to bear arms or any other state law. However, it does not prevent cooperation with federal authorities if their primary purpose is not investigating or enforcing new federal gun restrictions. Senator Missy Irvin is one of the sponsors. We are a country based on freedoms, and when our freedoms are threatened, we must take action through the tools within our U.S. Constitution and our Arkansas Constitution to protect those freedoms. Opponents of this measure say that it is unconstitutional. Now the governor must decide, will he sign this? Will he veto this or will he let it become law without his signature? He has five business days to make that decision and he has not indicated whether or not he supports this, but it does replace uh, other legislation that he vetoed earlier this week. So of course we will keep you updated on what happens. Reporting live at the state capitol, Michael Aaron, THV 11 News.